Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this uh, right triangle ABC as you can see in this uh, diagram such that its side lengths are uh, 32 and uh, 24 units. And moreover, this line segment uh, CE is uh, 10 units. And now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, blue shaded region. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Let me make it very clear that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's our action plan since we wanted to calculate the area of this uh, blue shaded region. So we can see that this uh, blue region area is going to be equal to the area of this uh, big triangle uh, ABC minus uh, the area of this uh, smaller right triangle uh, DBE. And now let's recall the area of a triangle formula. Area equals to a half time base times height. And if we focus on this uh, big triangle uh, ABC, our base is uh, 32 and our height is uh, 24. So we can easily calculate the area of this uh, triangle ABC. However, for this uh, smaller triangle uh, DBE, we don't know the base and the height of this triangle. Let me go ahead and call its uh, base as uh, X and Y as its height. And now we are going to calculate the value of X and Y before we calculate the area of this uh, triangle DBE. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this uh, big uh, triangle ABC. And we know that this is a right uh, triangle. So therefore we are going to use the Pythagorean theorem in order to calculate uh, its side BC. And now let's recall the Pythagorean theorem A square plus B square equal to C square. In our case, uh, our this longest leg, I'm going to call this side C. I'm going to call this side A and this side B. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this Pythagorean formula. A in our case is 32. So this is going to become 32 square plus B is 24 square equal to c square let's go ahead and simplify 32 square is 10 24 plus the next square is 576 equal to c square if we add both of them c square equals to 1600 let's go ahead and undo this square on both sides so our c value is going to be positive 40 and we know that our side C, this high part in use is same as the length BC. So therefore I can call length BC equals to 40 units. So therefore our this whole length BC turns out to be 40. And we know that our this length CE is 10 units. So therefore our this length EB is going to be 40 minus 10 is going to be 30 units. So therefore our this length EB turns out to be 30 units. Now let me show you an alternative method to this Pythagorean theorem. And we wanted to calculate this hypotenuse BC. And now let's recall 3, 4, 5 triplets. In other words, this 24 could be written as 3 times 8 and this 32 could be written as 4 times 8. And since this is a 3, 4, 5 special triangle, so its longest leg could be written as 5 times 8, which is equal to 40 units. So therefore, our hypotenuse turns out to be 40 units. And now we can see that these two angles are right angles so therefore these two lines are going to be parallel then we conclude that this uh, big triangle ABC is uh, similar to this uh, smaller triangle DBE according to angle angle similarity theorem since we can see that these are 90 degree angles this is our angle in common and these are our two corresponding uh, angles so therefore we are going to have uh, proportions so let's focus uh, on uh, these uh, two triangles we're going to have a ratio we can write uh, x divided by 30 let me go ahead and write down x divided by 30 equals to this uh, length 32 divided by 40 
So this is going to be 32 divided by 40. Now let's go ahead and multiply both sides by 30 to isolate uh, x and we can see this uh, 30 and 30 is gone so our x value turns out to be 24 units so therefore our this length uh, db turns out to be 24 units which is same as uh, x value now let's focus on another ratio y divided by x let me go ahead and write down y divided by x equals to 24 divided by 32 let me go ahead and write down 24 divided by 32 and we know our x value is 24 so i'm going to replace this x by 24 so therefore i can write y divided by 24 equals to 24 divided by 32 let's go ahead and multiply both sides by 24 to isolate y and we can see this 24 and 24 is gone so y turns out to be if we simplify the right hand side that is going to give us 18 units so therefore our length ed turns out to be 18 units which is equal to y value and here's our next step let's go ahead and calculate the area of this uh, triangle abc now and now let's recall the area of a triangle formula once again area equals to a half time base time height so therefore in our case our base is 32 and our height is 24 so this is going to become a half times 32 times 24 and that is going to be equal to 384 square units and now let's go ahead and calculate the area of this uh, smaller triangle dbe our base is uh, 24 and our height is uh, 18 so therefore i can write uh, 1 over 2 times base is uh, 24 times height is uh, 18 and if we simplify everything that is going to give us uh, 216 square units and now we know that the blue region area equals to the area of this triangle abc minus the area of this triangle db we already figured out the areas of uh, triangle abc and uh, db we are going to fill in the blanks so therefore this uh, blue region area is going to be 384 minus uh, 216 and if we subtract this thing that is going to give us uh, 168 uh, square units so thus the area of this uh, blue shaded region turns out to be 168 uh, square units that's our final answer thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye